Okay, so this is a small wind turbine testing setup where we've um, hired out one of these large industrial warehouse cooling fans which will move something like 37,000 meters cubed of air per hour. So it has a pretty high airflow, it's the biggest one that we could find. So we can try and simulate some of the higher wind speeds. We can actually get about 25, 26 mile an hour wind out of this at full power. So just a bit of an explanation of how I've set up this test rig. We've got this massive fan which blows at the small 100 watt turbine. It's not actually a perfect airflow out of this uh, fan. It tends to have a very high wind speed around the edge of it and near the centre of the fan is a much lower wind speed so in reality the airflow is going to be a lot more equal when it hits the turbine blade. When it hits the centre part of these turbine blades then that's what starts off the initial turning of the wind turbine. Um, so we've got turbine is fitted onto a 48mm diameter pole which is actually the same as a standard scaffolding pole uh, so they are fairly easy to get hold of um, we've got three phase output comes out of the turbine comes down the pole to the charge controller three phase input comes into the charge controller through these green wires and then we've got a 12 well, a charging voltage comes out of the uh, charge control, which is anything between around sort of 13 to 14 volts when the turbine is at full generation. And I've got two multimeters here. One is measuring the current flow from the charge controller into the battery, and the other is measuring the battery voltage at the moment of 12.35 volts. But when the turbine's spinning around, that's over 13 volts. And little uh, meter here which can calculate the actual wattage based on the current and voltage flow out of the charge controller. So we're going to power up the uh, fan, start the turbine spinning around. So I'm going to have to shout a little bit because this thing does get quite noisy. It takes a little bit of time to uh, build up speed. Down here, we've got a test rig with multimeter set up so I can measure both the current and the voltage output. I'm going to turn the fan up to a higher speed now. Where I'm taking the measurements now. 